Oh my God, it's time again. Look, oh my God, I'm wearing an American t-shirt as well. This is serious business, you know. You see this, the symbol of it. It's, it's time to punish someone. Time to pound someone. Might not be the correct choice of words. But anyway. Anyway, sort of a Jeff Silly Claw Hills. tirade. Shut up. Well, no, what you, is this you great shut respect up. for no, Jeff Claw? No, no, I wasn't talking. The you guy, keep talking the guy, the oh guy God, came up. Ram this fucking quarter dollar in your mouth, boy. Don't even know why it's turned up, but oh well. I'll do a show and tell another day. Now the question is, is Silver Heels in danger? You know, there's been a load of wild conspiracies. What is and it? I, think I don't Silver know Hills what it is. Arguably be the most Somebody explain it to me. Planet. I mean, there's a few screenshots, a few comments we need to analyze. Let's have a look now. In no particular order, Jay Silver Heels says, uh, anyway, here's how I view it playing out. Uh, Scott Natal. Oh my God, who's Scott Natal? Sounds like an idiot. He shows up at the door and knocks. I know what it is, but answer. Natal says, only businessman, I had to do it. Thanks for your hikes. Mows me down, Godfather style. Anyway, he says, I had to do it, Raph. He directed me. You were going to die anyway. And then I say, what about the sword, man? I almost got there first, like Muhammad Ali. I'm on top of the world, man. And then Jeff Clark replies, you have accused really Robin of wanting to stab you and carve an M on your chest. You have accused DJ Moore of wanting to shoot you with a moose gun. And now this, you have a persecution complex. And then Clark said, DJ Moore has the same content and you viciously attacked him. Silverheels replies, like hell I did. I would not attack that guy in the slightest bar none. The party is over, man. Party is over. What is the same content? Uh, uh, uh. He has cursed me out in correct times. How the hell did he viciously attack DJ Moore? I only made comments where he was full of shit to save him a trip and direct him more logically because I'm such a geologist. Him not being from the area and him using only old maps and probably hiking pole indentations and straps from the old west. I simply pointed out the correct spots where he was full of shit, man. And then Silverheels goes on to say, And I did it at no charge. When he was, is possibly arriving into the area, uh, he knows nothing about except for maps of springs from the Civil War. Jeff Clark replies, Topo maps are not Old West maps. They are gold standard for the US military. You accused him of wanting to shoot you with a moose gun. And then Silverheels went on to say, Like, what did he have before he was led into the light? In the name of Jesus, amen, Lord. Oh my God, get out of the Bible class right now. This ain't the time. Nothing more than old maps. Well, the lines are close together. That shows a ravine where the Elkar and probably J. Chuck. He used old Civil War maps and totally ignored all modern information. I'll go up and Civil War maps show spring. He very well could have survived. Uh, I gave him top quality info. Uh, no charge. He, he runs an outcam in which the dudes show up and gets a thousand per month. Man, why should I not charge him? Yes, I did say that, Clar. You know, at this rate, we're going to end up in a church next. Shh. So, okay, uh, yeah, wait, did this. I just hear Silver Hills? Oh, come on, Silver Hills, you might as well get your final words in. Come on, what have you got to say? Which motor mount is which on a 99 Mercury Villager or Quest? Over wow, so interesting. Thank you for sharing. Very enlightening. Anyway, uh, we'll see what happens next, because there'll be more to come. In brackets, there is, um, what was I going to say? In brackets, um, these are old screenshots, okay? You know, I need to clear the phone up, I need to cleanse the clutter. And I thought, well, I might as well just get this out just to provide a bit of information and updates around all the stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and goodbye.